Spencer, Spencer. What, you man? In there? I'm in. I'm on a phone call. Quiet. Oh, hang up the phone, oh, man. Yep. Hang up. No, Garrett. I'm talking. Oh, come sorry, on, man. Customer. Dang it. Goodbye. Talk to you later. Dang it. All okay. Right. Sorry. Yep. Yeah, sorry, man. customer. I'll call you back. No, no, they're gone. Okay. We have something important, man. We got to hit the road because I got a new vehicle. Oh, that's the staircase. Okay. Careful. I have careful. A new vehicle to pick up. And I need your help, and we got a great deal on it, and we're going to upgrade this thing, and it's going to be insane. Okay, we were taking the shop truck and trailer? Yes, sir. We're taking it. Nice purple trailer. I love this thing. Yeah, I, I picked the truck, guys, and, and Garrett's like, okay, okay, I'll pick the trailer. And he picked the purple trailer, man. What the heck? Okay, you know what? It looks cool, and it's unique. So, guys, let us know your thoughts on the trailer in the comment section. Okay, uh, hopefully we don't hit the trailer on the gate, man. Garrett also installed oh, the gates. We're, uh, we made it. Nice. There we go. You just have to be a good driver. Is it that hard? It is kind of that hard. So, Garrett, what kind of truck is this, man? Man, the truck is an F-250, and it is broken down, but I was reading, like, what they think the issue is, you know, because they try guessing, and we'll be able to fix this thing easily, and then we can suit it up. It's going to be nice. Okay, so this is kind of a project. Right now, if you guys saw in the shop, we got, like, nothing in the shop. I've been yelling at Garrett, we need some customers, and he's hanging up on customers. Garrett, I, Garrett, what? How do, how do we get there, man? I'm lost. How do you keep getting lost? You literally have the GPS. That's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll call your wife here. All right. It's a right. Yes. Okay. I knew it was this dealership. Okay. It, you know, Garrett, is the truck running? Might start up, but it's not going to be running for long if so. Okay. Uh, let's just here. Put the hazards on. Put any cones out. Okay. We don't have any cones. Let's just leave we it don't running. Got cones. All right. It's right over here. Okay. Check this thing out. Okay. This is it right here. Oh, oh, nice. Okay. What year is it? What year is it? I think it's a 2018. I could be wrong. It looks that like stuff. it. No, it looks like it. So it's uh oh, it's an XL 250. Okay, dude, this is like bare bones. Yeah, no, it's as basic as it gets, and that's what's perfect about it. Cause man, there's so much we can do. I want to like cut a hole in the roof, get some sun shining in, do so many different things. Garrett, why don't you go sign the papers with them? What are we paying for it? Man, take a guess. Okay, it, it has some transmission issues, some engine issues. Are we getting it for 13000 It's gasser. We're getting it for 12000 12000 okay, good deal, good deal. Yep, go talk to him. All right, I'm going to figure this thing out. The keys are in it. Please start. Come on. There we go. We got it to start. Spencer, they want it for thirteen. They heard us talking. Oh, they did? Uh, yeah. No, say eleven and a half, man. Ele oh, okay, okay. All right, I dropped the cash in and I'm running. All right, let's go. You do here 11 go, and a half, and you keep the 500 for me? Uh, totally, yeah. It's not in my pocket at all. Okay, perfect. All right, load it up. Get in the truck, man. Are they coming after us? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. I'm not going to look. Just I Just kidding, I guys. We, we aren't stealing the truck. It's strapped down. We're just paying a fair market price. I'm sitting in the back because Spencer smells. Yep, sit in the back. Thank you. Appreciate it. You know what? I'm sitting on the roof. Okay, yeah. While you're up there, can you help me back this thing up? So, like, you're the one with the pedals. Here, watch your head, man. I think there's some low-hanging wires here. I'll watch it. No worries about me. Do you want to stop go, at the gas right. station at all? Uh, for what? Mountain Dew? I don't know. Yeah, here, jump off. Get some Mountain Dew. All right. All right, see you later, man. See Wait, you back what? in the shop. Just kidding, guys. The gas station's right here. It's not that big of a deal, so he's just going to walk down there, grab some Mountain Dews, and walk it back. Okay, there we go. We need to widen that gate just a little bit there. All right, Garrett, you made it? I made it, and you're going to have to back this thing up yourself. Well, that's where we got this big lot. What I was thinking is we'll just drive it off and get her inside. Hopefully, she's still running. All right. Start it up. Oh. Uh, there we go. That started pretty good that time. All right. Get it off of there. We, we have a lot of work to do, man. All right. Get you want me to lift. drive it on or back it in? Uh, just back it in, maybe. Okay. Hopefully, it doesn't shut off by the time I get inside. Yeah, the transmission's kind of weird going from drive to reverse. It was... Kind of had a bad noise to it. That's not good. It's okay. We'll fix it all up. Again, we've got a great deal on it, so if we have to put in a bit of extra dollars, it should be okay. Good deal. Is that... Am I good? Tell me when. Uh, can try lifting it there. Let's see. 10-4. Come on. Should be good. Hope it's balanced. Oh, oh okay. Oh, back down. Garrett, come on, man. Yeah. Uh, so it turns out... Here, turn uh, it down. Lower it down. Try the lift stop working. Is it going to start? It's stuck? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Okay, so turns out that all the weights at the front. We're going to change all fluids, transmission. We're going to do all differentials, the transfer case for the four-wheel drive. We're going to do the oil, the coolant. 
man, let's just change the tires at the same time because okay. these things are just ugly to look at. Well, that took us about all day to get all the fluids out and then new rims and tires on here. New wheels and tires. It's looking good, Garrett. Yes, sir. I'm liking how it's looking. And I think we could probably drop it down for this next step because I just want to start kind of working on the body and make this thing instead of like a F250. Let's see if we can maybe make it look like a F450. Wait, we're, we can? Jay, I, can you actually do that? I think you to make it a legit F450, Garrett, you got to get like bigger axles, bigger brakes, bigger. Okay, okay. You got to like down. widen that and then you got to put two, okay. you know, the fender and stuff. Yeah, okay. Well, here's the thing. If we put the badges on and we change the interior, no one's going to ask you any questions. Really? Okay. Interesting. We'll, we'll ride in the fenders too. We'll do that as well. Just because. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, all right. We'll get working on that, but I, I'm tired. I'm going to go take a nap. I'll let what? you work on this. You know, this is a big job. Okay. I'll stay for a bit. Okay. Let's do it, man. Well, Garrett should be done by now. I, I, I did call back that customer. So if you guys are ever dealing with us and we start yelling on the phone, it's probably because Garrett's hanging it up for me. Garrett, what the heck, man? What, what is this? Man, I did it. This well, you put the fenders on. That doesn't mean anything. Okay, okay. Well, look, look, look. The interior's changed as well. Now I have the platinum trim. Oh, geez. So you put a whole new. So we've been ordering parts all last week, getting ready for this build. So a lot of this stuff we still have in here. Yes, sir. But it's a platinum now. Wow. Okay, here. Let me get on the inside. Yep. Geez, Garrett, that's a lot of work to do all the interior like that. I know you were sleeping through the, like the whole thing. Interesting. And then you put the dually fenders on here, but we don't have like actual duallys on here. Where yeah, are those? So we're waiting for them to come. We do have a spare set of duallys that we can put on, but like they, they're honestly pretty bad. Like there's nothing special about them. So we're going to just wait that out. I want to put on the bar at the front, something kind of make this thing look mean. Let's get this thing on here. Okay. All right. That install wasn't too bad. And the lift comes in handy too. Yes, it does. But man, I'm looking at this thing and obviously we're going to change the paint color of the whole vehicle later. Yep. But do you like this chrome? I'm not the biggest fan of it. Uh, It's not bad. Yeah. But blacking it out, you can't go wrong with that. Exactly what I was thinking. All right. You know what? Let's bring in the paint booth real quick and get that done. Heck yeah. Let's get her changed over. <laughs> Garrett, that turned out better than I thought, man. Nice, nice, nice call on that. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Well, honestly, it's kind of like a mutual decision. Sit in the interior for a sec okay. and look up. Yeah. What about it, man? Okay, so there's a roof, and it really makes a vehicle feel a lot smaller than it is. So I was thinking, what if we just cut a giant hole, throw in some glass, and we got a moonroof? Well, Garrett got done with this, and I was at the office, but he went to get me some food, and that turned out pretty good. I thought he was just talking about one. We're doing the whole roof as glass now. That's pretty nice. I think the next thing on the to-do list, Garrett was talking about putting a toolbox in. I think it's actually, oh yeah, that's right. It's one of the, it's in one of these boxes. We'll figure it out. But anyway, just a standard stainless steel toolbox should look really nice. Garrett, quit eating McDonald's in there, man. Look at the toolbox I just installed. Oh, you got it done? Yes, sir. Oh, that's looking pretty nice, man. Look at this truck over, like ignore the tires, but. It's looking pretty nice already. Like we've really done some work to it. Yeah, going from I going from an XL Garrett, which is like base trim. We literally bought this thing for eleven thousand five hundred dollars and yeah, we've been putting a lot of money into it, but yeah, it's turned out pretty good. Oh yeah, but man, we're missing a pretty important thing right now. We have no hitches. Yep. I was thinking gooseneck and then a really nice uh I forget the brand, but maybe the Anderson hitch there. Some gonna drop down back there? Yep. Should should be good. All right, well, let's get that installed. It should be pretty easy. Well, those were pretty expensive, but yeah, we got the fifth wheel plate in and then just a super nice, like that's like $250 hitch there. So pretty expensive stuff. Uh, mud flaps, we got to do, uh, what else were you saying, Garrett? I, the mud flaps are up here, aren't they? Yeah, I actually here. don't know where they are. No, so. it says it right here. Ready? Catch. Uh, okay. Got it. And then the, go. the running boards are up here too. We'll have to get those on next. All right. All right, you better get to work. I'm going to go take an, another nap, man. Man, you are the laziest worker I've ever no, met. No, I work too hard. I I got to re replenish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go okay. to sleep. Go to sleep. Count your sheep. There we go. We got the mud. Er, not mud flaps. Well, we did get the mud flaps, but the running boards are in. Mud flaps look solid. Garrett, we where are these dually tires, man? Man, we're going to get them, but man, I got ramps in here. Okay, nice. Yeah, that was a big one. 
it's really come together all the add-ons and accessories built-in ramp so if you're driving a four-wheeler the only thing is we have the fifth wheel plane that we'll figure it out but that those ramps come in handy yeah but man check this out when i hop on in it senses my weight so it folds up the steps like that there you go yeah that's the that's that's what comes with the platinum man that's for sure so this is a two-tone truck so we're gonna be painting it the i don't know what kind of paint color but something crazy isn't that right garrett yeah some kind of bright color should sell pretty good want to wanted to get the clicks on our images when we post them online so. that's right that's right fold up those ramps and let's get her to the paint booth well garrett garrett it's looking it's looking pretty good yeah man the paint seems pretty dry the blue's good but... i don't know about the silver dude the two-tone the bottom tone i don't love it when i first looked at it i was thinking about that too what if we change it to black so it kind of matches like that front bumper <sighs> let's see yeah yeah do you think that would look good yeah, let's do black. Let's see what, see what that looks like. Okay, and then at the same time, I think it's now finally just, well, let's just get these tires off here and switch them out yeah. for some dualies. Even if they aren't the like final dualies, we need something that fits the body of this truck. Yeah, for sure. Before we, yep, I agree. I agree. All right, let's get her painted back and then get the new wheels on. Well, there she is. Garrett's got it done. He just went for a test drive. Garrett, can you give me a ride? Man, I can give you a ride. Hop on in. Heck yeah. I think the black looks really good. It's like a kind of a flat finish and I, heck. And then I think we did a, what do you call it? Like the bed liner finish so it doesn't rust and stuff. Yeah, this thing should be able to handle all the elements. You ready? Yep, I'm ready, man. Just don't crash it. Don't go too... I know you're a crazy driver, but this is a new truck. Okay, but we're going to have to test out what this can do. We Careful, can stay on the road, road, man. Stay on the road. You're in man, the bushes. I'm, I'm testing the suspension. We're good. Okay, okay. Nice and easy, dude. This thing... I I like the color. I wasn't too sure about the blue, man, but it turned out... Garrett, careful. We're good. We're good. Here, you know what? Let's go off-road. No, Garrett, stay on the road. Stay on the road. That's not your field. Oh, no. Okay, we don't even Come have on, the man. mud tires on yet. It's okay. We got dualies on the back. Okay. Thank goodness the field's kind of smooth and stuff. It hasn't rained in a bit. Garrett, we're getting it kind of muddy. Uh, not really. It's pretty good. No, oh, we're destroying fields. Oh, oh, no. Garrett, come on, man. Garrett. Spencer. What the heck? Spencer. Dude, get that. Okay. Oh, my goodness, guys. We wrecked it. Garrett, all that work for nothing. But we can, um... Yeah. We'll fish it out. We'll fish it out. But heck, that's a lot of... Oh, my goodness. Okay. Well, guys, that's the end of the video. I am firing Garrett. Let me know what you guys think we should charge him with. I don't know. Garrett, you owe me all the money or something. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.